Are you getting error messages such as P165, 74 or 78 on your Ring app? All these error codes correspond to your Ring doorbell being offline. So how do you fix it? Well, we just might know what you need to do to get this issue fixed. So stick around till the end of this video and make sure to follow all the steps that I mentioned to find the right fix for you. One of the prime reasons for your Ring doorbell to go offline often is a failing power supply. In the absence of a properly charged battery or an unstable power supply, your Ring cameras will have a hard time sustaining your network connection. And so, the first thing that you need to do is to make sure that your camera is getting sufficient power. In the case of battery-powered Ring doorbells, check if the battery has enough charge from the Ring app itself. If not, make sure to juice it up properly. With wired ring doorbells, ensure that sufficient power is being supplied to your doorbell. You might need a multimeter handy to check the power supply. Also, make sure that all the cables are connected snugly to your cameras. Any loose connections can mess up the power supply. A poor network connection with subpar speeds, high latency, and low signal strength can also be a reason behind your Ring doorbell going offline. And the best way to check for the stability of your network is to run a network test directly from the Ring app itself. Ring has designed and supplied an in-house network testing feature in the Ring app itself for all its connected cameras, making it much easier for end users like you and me to ascertain issues with the network. Once you've connected your camera to your Wi-Fi network, you can access the test the connection on the Ring app by opening the settings tab by tapping on the menu icon from the top right of the thumbnail of your doorbell. Then select the device health dial and navigate to the test your Wi-Fi dial. Select start test to get a detailed report of your network connection. Make sure to check if the speeds latency and signal strength is at fault here. If you come across any such inconsistencies, consider power cycling your internet router. By power cycling your router, you get to refresh your network connection and make sure that the Wi-Fi provided by your router connects to your ring doorbell as seamless as possible. All you need to do is unplug your router from its power source and plug it back in after a minute or two. You can also switch your network off your ring doorbell to a different Wi-Fi if you're facing network issues. And the best and arguably the simplest method to do that is to host your own carrier internet using your mobile's hotspot feature. Once you've hosted the hotspot of your phone using your mobile carrier network, head over to the device tab and select your doorbell from the list of devices. Then select device health. Now navigate to the change network tile and follow the on-screen steps to change the network. Select the Wi-Fi network hosted by your mobile and check for the issue now. If you have your ring doorbell and your router placed far away, the signal strength may not be the best, which can in turn result in your ring doorbell going offline often. Since your doorbell typically can't be repositioned, you're only left with the option of repositioning your internet router. So make sure to position your router in such a way that there are the least amount of obstacles between your router and your doorbell. So generally speaking, the closer they are to each other, the better. You could also opt for Wi-Fi extenders or mesh networks to further enhance the signal. If none of the fixes that I've mentioned so far seems to work for you, you might need to consider resetting your Ring doorbell. In performing a factory reset, you get to revert all the system settings and user data of your Ring doorbell, and this can also wipe out any potential bugs and errors that might have cropped up in your device over time. To perform a factory reset on your Ring doorbell, unscrew and remove its back panel to reveal its orange reset button. Press and hold this button for about 10 seconds to initiate the reset process. Wait for the reset to complete, set up your Ring doorbell like new and all your issues with your Ring doorbell going offline should go away. And with that, I believe that I've touched on everything that I wanted to talk about regarding fixing a Ring doorbell that keeps going offline. If you found this video useful, consider leaving your thoughts on this video below, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more Ring content like this. 